what's going on, all you ghouls and ghosts out there. My name is Mike Macabre, and welcome to the graveyard. As always, if you like what you see, like, subscribe, comment, share the video, hit that notification bell so you don't miss any more of my reaction videos, Friday Night Frights, or whatever else I am doing on this channel. But Merry Christmas, everybody. Yes, yes, yes. All along the world, if you celebrate Christmas and the holidays and Hanukkah or whatever else you celebrate, hopefully you're celebrating with people you love and you can tolerate and all that fun stuff. Stay safe, all that. Enjoy yourselves. But on tonight's episode, we have another reviews and reactions. And coming back to the channel on this Christmas day is Los Haibas. And we're going to be reacting to their song, Bosques Virgin Alice which I do believe translates to Virgin Forests. And we have a lot of requesters for this. So let's get right into all those names. Alda Kaim, Victor Antonio Perigutier, Jota27, Richard Damien, Claudio Quinones, Teo Cosi, Jonathan H.E., JCGA1208, Isadora Fuentes, Hugo Abarzua, Charles Clift, Perla Intvin, Christian Mora, Christian Fernandez, and King James. They all wanted me, re uh, wanted me to react to this Los Haibas song. So I think this has been the most requested song that I've ever had on the channel. So kudos to all of you for requesting this. Um, I have not heard this Los Haibas song, so I'm going into it blind. But if I recognize it, I'll let everybody know, be as transparent as possible. But without further ado, the link to the original video will be in the description box for your viewing pleasure at your leisure. But let's jump right in. All right, ghouls and ghosts. Bosques Virginalis. The Virgin Forests. Spacey, trippy. And then you have their native instruments. Love the soundscape so far. The artwork feels very appropriate. Like the bass, I think he's slapping it. Sway to it. Very wispy vocals. Getting a higher register.
a super catchy song. <coughs> like this solo here. Come in the pianos. Somber. Very operatic vocals here. It's harmonizing so fucking well.
And here comes the spacey, trippy. Ooh, that was a trip and a half. I have a lot to think about and a lot to talk about with this song. See in the review section. All right, ghouls and ghosts. That was Los Haibas with their song Bosquez, Virgin Alice, Virgin Forests. I can see why so many people requested this song, but I'll get to that in just a second. The people who requested this particular reaction are Alda Keim, Victor Antonio Pereira Gutier, Jota27, Richard Damien, Claudio Quinones, Tio Cosi, Jonathan HE, JCGA1208, Isadora Fuentes, Hugo Abarzua, Charles Clift, Perla Infine, Christian Mora, Christian Fernandez, and King James. They all request, requested Virgin Forests. Again, the link to the original video will be down in the description box for your viewing pleasure at your leisure. Now, uh, this was quite the track, and I had to look up the lyrics just to see how everything fit together, because this, this track was something else. <laughs> Through virgin forests of another age, initial mists are back. It seems that I am going to look to illuminate. Illuminate. Looks like I'm going to find some crazy star at the bottom of the sea. The night is very black. I don't see anything. It's empty, and the wind does not murmur the dawn. Everything is in you without more reason. What an illusion of eternity. That's very powerful. My life will be reborn in you. Existence is soul, my love. Very, very interesting lyrics. The soundscape was just incredible in this song. It started off very spacey and trippy and otherworldly. And then it came in with the native instruments. The the um, I keep forgetting what it's called, but it's like a very long, like flute pipe kind of thing. <laughs> um, and then you had the uh, bombastic kind of almost jazzy drums, and then you had the scathing guitars and the guitar solo from El Gato. Uh, amazing vocals. It was kind of subdued in the beginning, but then it got more operatic as the um. As the track went on, the flow in which the instruments played upon one another at certain parts where they fold together, at other parts where they kind of built upon one another, absolutely perfection in my book as far as that's concerned. Absolutely loved every single aspect of this song from top to bottom. In fact, I think this is my favorite Los Haibas song that I've heard so far. I love that kind of trippy music anyways, so this was a real treat for me. You had you know, your spacey parts, you had your somber parts, you had your more up-tempo parts. It was kind of getting a little tensive there, and then it crescendoed, but then it kind of 
went back down to the spacey and calm. Piano work was absolutely phenomenal with the song. They didn't over... Uh, no particular instrument overrode one another. They all fit and flowed so well in this track. Um, I don't remember how long it was. I think it was like nine minutes long. It didn't feel like that at all. I definitely wanted a, a longer song, and that's uh, that's a rare thing for me. Um, I mean, but, you know, given uh, for prog rock, they tend to have a lot longer songs. Um, but it, I was not bored with this in the least. So I think everybody knows what kind of score I'm going to give this. If I could give it more than five skulls, I would, but I'm <laughs> five skulls out of five. Absolutely. Uh, didn't have to think about that at all. <laughs> I just, I, this is one of the uh, few songs where I, I will continue to listen to it after I am done here. I might even show my dad this particular track. Uh, track. He loves uh, some prog rock, some Pink Floyd. So I wonder how he's going to feel about it. But I definitely want to show him. As a matter of fact, today is his birthday. Christmas Day he was born. So we'll we'll see how that goes. <laughs> um, if anybody wants to know how, his reaction to it, um, I can definitely put it in the comment section when, if and when he decides to listen to the track. Um, but if you don't want me to, I won't. Uh, let me know in the comment section the six feet under. I would greatly appreciate it. But I think that's going to be it for this episode of Reviews and Reactions. As always, if you like what you saw, like, subscribe, comment, share the video, hit that notification bell so you don't miss any more of my reaction videos, Friday Night Frights, whatever else I'm doing on this channel. Also, again, Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, Happy Holidays, whatever you celebrate. Hopefully you're celebrating it with La Familia or any else that you, know, that you love. But as always, ghouls and ghosts, stay festive. Ah, wow.